Hey guys, it's Danielle. Welcome back to my channel. Um, today I am doing a Mara. Anyways, my dog. She wants to play. It's cold outside here in Texas and she's a husky. What can I do? She just wants to play. Anyways, um, so I'm doing a mini makeup haul and um, let's just jump right into it. I'm going to be doing swatches and showing you um, the stuff that I uh, just recently got in the mail. Um, so the first thing I want to talk about is this little tool right here. It is a rose gold bl uh, blending tool from Glamour Dolls. This is what it looks like. I just thought it was so pretty. It's very soft. Um, I can't wait to play around with it and see how well it blends on my eyes and eyeshadows. But um, it was rose gold, which is my favorite. I love rose gold stuff. Um, but I had to get it. And it was a dollar. A dollar. Well, it well, beats a dollar. Come on. Um, anyways, the next tool is... Ah, look at it. This is one of the Glamour Dolls and Lisa Frank collaboration brushes. It's a blending brush. <sighs> I got the um, <laughs> the um, contour tool that they had put out with her, and then I saw that they restocked this, and I was like, I have to have it. It brings back all my 90s feels. I was a 90s baby, so I was just, I'm upset. <laughs> Moving on, I got two more things from the Glamour Doll website. I'm not sure about them just yet. I haven't used them, but they are these two little things right here. And um, they're lip glosses. They were also $1. So, <laughs> we will see what they do. Let's swatch them real quick. Oh, okay. It's a lot less purpley than I thought. Okay. Well, this is the pinky colored one guys it's um i thought it was gonna be more like a purple because i kind of wanted to do like a unicorn makeup tutorial one day but um it's a little more pink but it's nice it um it does have like a not a very good smell but you know we can maybe look past that we'll see let's see what this nude one it's like a nudie peachy kind of color let's see how that looks on my skin. These would probably be better if you um, like line your lips first because they are very sheer. They're not very, they're not that pigmented. But that's okay. I don't mind lining my lips or throwing it on top of like another lipstick or something. They're pretty. They're pretty. I will have to test those out soon. Um, the next thing I got is from ColourPop. I actually have already used this. I talked about this in my favorite of 2017 videos. It's um, their Supernova eyeshadows. Guys, if you like the Stila eyeshadows, these are a very similar product. They, they're they they're like a dupe for it. Um, they're very, they're more metallic-y than the Stila shadows, but they're still very gorgeous. And this one is one of my favorite favorites that ColourPop has came out with. Let me just show you guys. It's very pretty. It is It is in the shade Moon Moonlit. Look at that right there. Oh, it's so pretty and it's I mean, come on. So sparkly and shiny. I love it. Now if only they'd come out with a rose gold kind. I'd be in heaven. I'd be in heaven. It'd be all over my lid. All over. The next things are all... This is just going to be a ColourPop kind of video, guys. Um, I got two lippy sticks from them. I haven't used these just yet. Um, this one is in the shade Parker. And I do like this. And I'm running out of hand. I have to switch my hand. Let me go to this side. That is what it is. Pretty. Um, it's a very pretty, pretty nude color. Um, you could probably wear that every day. I'm excited to play with this stuff later. Then this one, it is red, and it is called Weekender. 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 
and that is what that looks like. It is a very true red color. That'd be fun for a night out, or you know, if you're just feeling extra glam, throw on a red lip, add some sparkle. Mm. Now, let's get into the eyeshadows. And the first eyeshadow that I got is called Dare. Looks like this. It's a very pretty purpley color. Ooh, and it's shimmery too. And these are their super shock shadows. Okay, it's more glittery than anything. That purple shade right there. That'd be pretty with that moonlight color, I bet. Ooh, I got it all over the packaging. Okay. Anyways, the next one is one that I've already used before. I talked about this in my favorites video too. This is in the shade Revolution. It's a very pretty pinky-ish color. Let's watch that right here. And that right there is what it looks like. Very sparkly, very sweet. Ma, I swear, every time I film, it's like she needs something. I'm gonna have to put her up every time I film now. She wants to go outside. I know what it is she wants. The next one I have, this one, it's this reddish burgundy color. It is in the shade Paradox. And that is right there, that color right there. It's a kind of matte red color. Probably didn't even need that because I have the Jaclyn Hill palette and she has several reddish colors that are similar to that. Let me get my rag real quick and wipe my hands off so I can do some more swatches for you guys. Alright, three more shadows to go. Um, like I said, it's a mini haul. I didn't get tons and tons of stuff. But I am putting in a Sephora order really soon. I can't wait to show that 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 with you guys. Alright, this one is in the shade Liberty. It looks like this. The silvery kind of color. Ooh. Ooh, I can't wait to play with this one. This one is pigmented. Ooh, look at that. That one is very pigmented. It just, just smooths right on. I love it. That's, I can't wait to play with that one. And I'm dropping stuff. <sighs> the next one, I'm going to have to wash all these packages off because I keep opening with the hand I'm swatching with. This one is coconut, and it's this very pretty, dark, metallic-y blue color. This one, the, when I saw this one on the website, I was like, ooh, I gotta have it. And that, I can, I can kind of see it, I'm running out of room on my hands. It's like a dark dark blue that'd be pretty on your outer corners if you're feeling kind of blue <laughs> and then the last one I have right here this is in the shade cusp and looks like like that it's like a grainy blue kind of color it's pretty let's see I always hate swatching these because they're so pretty and then when you swatch them, the little design and stuff on them kind of goes away. Ooh, that's pretty. I like that. And then right here is Cuss. That's pretty. I'm not normally a greeny kind of person on my eyes, I just don't think it really looks that great on me, but I'm willing to go outside of my comfort zone and try new colors. Um, Colourpop recently just released a bunch of new 
super shock shadows and they're bright and colorful and uh, I can't wait to get my hands on them. I want to play with them. They look, they just look absolutely gorgeous, guys. Um, anyways, that was my little mini haul. Um, I hope you liked it. If you have any requests that you would like to see, if you have products you want to see me test out, please leave that in the comments down below and I will get on it as soon as possible. Um, as always, guys, give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Um, please subscribe to my channel before you leave. Thank you so much. Bye, guys.